I wish to speak to you now. So here are the strangers who enter my kingdom. I bid you welcome. Come, let us talk. Greetings, mighty travelers. I am Moth Amon, magician, sage, and overlord of Mandoria. Tell me, why have you come into my realm? Greetings, Moth Amon. I am Dr. Claire Savage, scientist, explorer, and duck of action. I am here to find the monitoring station of the Old One. You mean the Ancient One? That is a dark name, a name of terror. The Manders destroyed his monuments long ago. Only their valor and strength saved us from that dark demon. Everybody else reveres the memory of the Old One, but the Manders do not. What happened to make them turn their back on him? The Ancient One's Fane is a place of death and terror. Why would you seek it? Are you worshippers of the Ancient One? <laughs> Should we fear you? We mean no harm. I believe your legends are incomplete. In my home, there is another such place. There are powerful secrets inside. And you have glimpsed these secrets. Will you teach them to me? I am always eager to learn more of the magical arts. I'm not sure how much use they would be to you. I've come to find the Fane so it can help me unravel the mysteries of the one back home. I understand. Perhaps I can help you in your search. Let us speak in the atrium within. Lord Mothamban orders your doom. Guardians attack! Welcome back to episode 318 of the Death Walkthrough. Today we are apparently heading straight into a dungeon with Mandorian Guards. There's a rank 18 myth and a rank 18 fire. Not too difficult, I don't think. Uh, the myth has 4,105 health and the fire has 4,055. And as always, I assume normal resist rules apply. Um, so yeah, I think just one blade in the scarecrow should be good. Should be good. Hopefully Minotaur. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, spooky scary. This is gonna do a little bit. Oh, my pet hatched two. Wow, he's bad. He's trash, he's trash, only two. Oh my gosh. Man, these guys are actually really bad. Probably helps when they don't crack. Why would you stun? No. Oh my gosh, how dare they? How dare they stun me? This is just absolutely ridiculous. How am I meant to do anything now when I'm stunned? This is just, oh. They, they have outplayed me. They have outplayed me and outsmarted me. This is so sad. Stun me again, I dare you. Nope. Immolate. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What a... What a man's. What a man's. Immolating. Holy moly. That did a decent amount as well. Jeez. Jeez. Holy moly. Um, right. Scarecrow should kill, hopefully. If not, I cry. That's, that's all that happens. If it doesn't kill, I cry. I cry myself to sleep at night all the time um we do crit and does it kill it does nice fantastic easy clap very good very very good super easy fight let's go next well done wizard i knew that magician wasn't trustworthy let's repay his hospitality come on hospitality that didn't seem very hospitable of them um but that's fine. You dare withhold magical secrets from me? Now you will learn the price of defiance. Petty tyrants are always shouting idle threats. Soon you'll get a taste of justice, you fiend. Right, we have some palace warriors. Rank 18 fire. Kind of the same as the other ones, I would assume, but just slightly different. Um, they have 4,055 health as well. Wow, who would have thought? Crazy. Uh, we didn't get a blade. That's really unfortunate. Really unfortunate. They're gonna stun me, double stun me right off the bat. Told ya. Told ya. There's another one coming right up here, and they'll remove my stun shield, and then they'll stun me again next round, and I'll be just stunned. Why did I know that was gonna happen? I'm... Okay. Yep. I just predict the future now. I am not a necromancer anymore. I am a, um, uh... uh what are they called? The people who predict the future? I don't know. I can't remember the name. I was going to do such a cool thing and then I just forgot. Brain, why you do this to me? No. No. I'm going to blade next and they're going to stun me again. 
100% guaranteed. Watch them stun me right now. Again, double stun. It's going to be great. It's going to be fantastic. Really cool. Really good. Um, just kidding. They'll both immolate. They'll either immolate or double stun. Oh my gosh, a fire zilla. Wow. Actually, is it a burning rampage? It could be a burning rampage. It's not a burning rampage. It's just a fire zilla. Oh no, it is burning rampage. Uh oh. Too bad we're going to be over this fight before it goes off. Lucky, lucky. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Did he even crit that? I don't even think he crit that. Um, okay. They didn't stun me, which is handy. Which is very good. And we go for a nice wee scarecrow. And they die. Hopefully. Fingers crossed, maybe. Most likely, probably. Kablam. Scarecrow action. Boom, ba -doom, boom, 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 boom. Crit and blade. And they did. Oh, one of them didn't die. This is so sad. No. No, why would you do this to me? Why? Why? We will go for an old one next. Don't stun me. Does this stun me? I can't remember if this stuns me or mantles me. Either way, I'm not here for it. I don't like it. I don't appreciate it. This is absolutely not fair. Zero out of ten. Would not recommend. It's a mantle. Okay. I think it's like a pretty decent mantle as well. Like 65 or something. We, we can't see it. Okay, that's great. That's really cool. I love this game so much sometimes. We'll just do this and hope it kills. And hope we don't fizzle. Okay. Don't know how, how mantled that mantle was, but um, that's fine. We didn't fizzle, so it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. This is such a cool spell. I love him. I love him. He is so cool. He is so cool and good. And powerful and he's dead. Yup, he very dead. Super dead. That mist, it's spores of the Black Lotus. Deadly poison. We have to find a way out of here. There, pry open that panel, quick. Right, oh no, it's really misty. I don't like this. This is not great. This is not great or a good. A tunnel. No time to worry about where it leads. Go, and I'll seal the panel behind us. Um, I don't know if just going into a random tunnel is any way a good idea, but whatever. <sighs> That was too close. Hopefully we can find a way out down here. You there! You're no guards by Grom! Release me from this cage! Okay. Hello, Mandar. How is it going? By Mithra! I know your face! Have you come to taunt me? I thought I had killed you! Dog! Duck! Thank you very much. I see your manners have not improved. You talk of manners? Open this cage, and I shall teach you manners, feathered fool! Give me one last taste of combat before Moth kills me! This poor Mander is imprisoned, and the not-good Moth will kill him. We should help him. Help him? Are you sure, wizard? This Mander can be quite a handful, I assure you. Why should we set you free, barbarian? Revenge! I was king of Mandoria by my own hand until that sorceress dog, Moth Ammon, stole my crown from me. By Grom's teeth, I will know vengeance. Still, you stay your hand. Very well. Free me from this accursed cell, and I'll help you escape this place. In Grom's name, I swear it. All right. We shall see if we can trust you. Uh, uh. The bars. I can't break them. I'm still too weak. How do we open the doors? The jailer has a key that will open this door. You'll find him in there. Go rattle his skull for me. The dog deserves far worse. I'm sure. Let's go, wizard. Right, let's go. Next next dungeon. This is like double dungeons today. Holy moly. Two dungeons in one time. Wow. Crazy, crazy, crazy. We even have a boss in this one. Whoa. Who would have thought? Not me, that's for sure. Um, yeah, let us free Mandar. Sounds like a good guy. Probably. Greetings. We need to talk to the jailer urgently. Who in Uruk's name are you? We'll take you to the jailer, all right. In chains? Guards, get them! Right. Three dungeon keepers. Lorank 19 Elite. Very spooky. Very, very spooky. Um, they're Storm. They have, uh, 4,195 health. Not too much. Not too much, but there is three of them. So, slightly annoying. 
slightly annoying, but that's fine. We can deal with it pretty easily. That's a weird trap. And this is also a blade. Okay. And this will also be a blade by the sounds of it. Oh no, he's given pips to himself. Fair enough. Understandable. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. That's a great spell. Great, great work. You're going to cast what? A sirens on me and remove my blade and pretend that it's a good spell? I don't know. I don't know. We need to get another blade because we cannot kill with a ship of fools if we only have one blade, unfortunately. If we had a scarecrow, that would have been fantastic, but we don't. Storm Elf. Yikes. Just kidding. I'm not actually worried at all. It's going to do like five damage. Um, so, yeah. Actually, three damage, so even 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 less than I thought it would. <laughs> oh, man. 90 flat resist comes in handy so much. I love it. I love having so much flat resist. It's great. That hurt. Oh, my gosh. What the heck? Why he try kill me? No. No. Stop. Stop. This is not fair. 173. Oof. Okay. Okay. That's fine. Yikes. Yikes, we have to hit next. <laughs> I'm worried about this last dude. He's going to do, like, some crazy stuff, I swear. Um, we're going to Scarecrow just so we know that we kill. Also, we get bigger heal, so it'll be good. Bigger heal is better. Okay, pips. Nice. Two pips. Fantastic. Cool. Good job, dude. Good job. Uh, he's blading. Oh, no, he's giving himself but He's just really wanting pips. He's he's a pippy boy, that's for sure. Um, crazy. Three pips. Why does he get three? I don't understand. Right, three damage here. Nice. Solid three damage. Very cool. Actually, this will do probably about five, I would say. Oh, it did zero. Even worse. <laughs> I keep overestimating how much damage it's going to do. Wow. Who knew that I was just this good? <laughs> I thought it would do more because um because of the aura. But then I think the aura is actually less than a trap. So I should have realized that it would still do zero. Um, but that's fine, I guess. <laughs> that's fine. That's, that's how math works or something. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, GG. Easy clap. Very cool. Very good. They're dead. Did sound kind of weird, not gonna lie. Kind of weird. You see, these manders will fight at the drop of a hat. Looks like we'll have to find this jailer the hard way. I like the hard way. It makes me feel better. Because, yes. Are any of you the jailer? Anyone? Seize them! Here we go again. Right, and by again, she means they're exactly the same guys, so I'll be back in a sec. These prisons seem endless. Hopefully we can find the key before Mothamon realizes we're down here. Right, we're back. We finished it. Not too bad. Just the same as the other one. Oh, here's the jailer. Uh-oh. You're not supposed to be down here. Who are you? Dr. Claire Savage Jr., the Duck of Bronze and Champion of Justice. And I need your key. My key? Ha! You'll never take it, Bronzebill fool. <laughs> Have it your way. Right, let us do this. Let us quickly put in a faint, just in case. Just in case. This is life. Could be some death shields. Would be bad. Um... So yeah, we're not going to prepare for that. But anyway, if it does happen, it happens. Oh, well. Um, let us blade up a little bit. So this guy is rank 20 boss. 13,275 health. Not too bad. Not too bad. And obviously the minion's just the same as before. Not great at all. They'll probably just spam pips and blades and traps. And then and then cast like a storm elf or something crazy like that. Yeah, they're great. You know, maybe they'll cast Thundersnake. Who knows? That would be a that would be a sight. Thundersnake doing like five damage to me. Oh my gosh! Imagine that. That would be crazy, 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 crazy. Um. Yeah. Right. Let us. Do we faint? Thirteen thousand. We're gonna blade up as much as we can, and then we'll faint, and then we'll hit. I think that's the plan here. This is a weakness. No. Okay. That's an interesting hex spell that you have. They're very interesting. No, he does not need more pips. I'm sorry. He does not need more pips. Nope. Nope. Sorry. Sorry, but no, I don't agree with this statement. He does not need more pips. I'm going to get out those minions as soon as possible. I might just hit with the Scarecrow next. And then Blade and Faint into the, into the Grim. And I think that's probably a good idea. Just because the minions are not good, but they're just annoying. And if they're giving him pips all the time, I don't like that. I don't like that, because I don't know what spells this dude has, and if there's anything that will really frustrate my plan, 
not great. Actually, okay, so we're just going to faint. We've got to scrap that strategy because we didn't get an enchant for a scarecrow and I don't want to use the ship of fools. Oh, new life spell. Hog. Very cool. Tarzan, but old one. Tar's old one. Yep, that, that's how it works, definitely. Um, ouch, just a little bit hurt. Just a little bit of hurt there. Not too much, just a little bit. One, two, hurts a bit. Um, right, what is this? He's going to hit me with the storm elf. Oh no, Thunderman. Another staple of their diet. You know, changing the changing the bubble. that They've already changed, like, what, three times this fight already? Yep, very important. Very important, because I definitely have something to do that with myself. Obviously, because I am just a professional at this game. I carry bubbles everywhere I go, you know? All four of them, because you can only have four of them now, which is so stupid. I understand for PvP, but for out of PvP, kind of stupid. Um, okay, we got this. We, get, we do this. We do this. We, we boost. He no shield. He no shield. No shield. Thank you for no shield. We appreciate no shielding. We appreciate you. We appreciate you, sir. Um, this is a blade. Yup, blade. Lovely. And we hit, and we kill, and we die. Fanta- No, we don't die. They die. Obviously, I would never die. I'm- I have never died ever in my life. So, yeah. This wizard has only been alive. It didn't kill! No! Oh well, it's fine. I expected it not to kill. We have a shad. We'll just blade, I think. We have another blade. Into the grim and it will easy clap kill because, yeah. Um, we did pip can surf, which is kind of nice. Kind of like that. Kind of like that for us. We do this into the grim and 2000 easy clap for the grim, especially with boost. Oh no. Oh no. Minus 90. Oh, just as well. I carry cleanse. This is painful. This, this, this bit here, pain, pain. This is pain. This is pain. Pain. Minus 90. Why? Why? Why you do this? Why you do this? Do you not care about me? How dare you, Mr. Jailer? So rude. Um, I have cleanse though, so it's fine. I carry cleanse for this reason. For this very reason. Everyone's like, oh, just carry snack attack. It'll be fine. But why would I do that when I can just not do that and carry cleanse? It does the same thing, you know. It, it does literally the same thing. It gets rid of a minus 90. See no difference. See no difference. Plus, I can guarantee I will get cleanse because it's the only thing in my side deck. So, you know. Whereas I may not have a shad. And I may want to hit with the scarecrow instead because, you know, need drain. Whereas cleanse, just so much more useful. Just saying. Just saying. Um, right, he's dead. Bye. Bye, Jayla. Bye. Bye. Oh, what? Here's the key. I still think we're taking a risk freeing the barbarian, but I'll follow your lead. Let's see if he's as good as his word. Okay, um, that was interesting. Was not expecting my pet to cast Mass Faint at the end. Like, what? I didn't know that would trigger Mass Faint. I thought it was only trapping. But apparently, it's not only trapping. It's also that spell. So maybe it's, like, negative things. Because that does give, I think, two uh, weaknesses. Yeah, two 25 weaknesses. So maybe maybe that is something that triggers it as well. I don't know. I, I don't see it cast enough. Because I don't trap too much. So, yeah. That's just a thing. Free, I thank you, bronze bird. And you too, strange one. Who am I? Ha! You must come from far away if you've not heard of. Manda! The Barbarian! This is not the first time I've been imprisoned in this place. I know a way out. Come. Okay, he's a criminal by trade, apparently. But yeah, Manda, the Barbarian. We have freed him. Sounds we are free! Fun. Ha! Vile sorcerer! You should have known no prison can hold Manda! He sits on my throne for now, but soon I'll take it back. Hm. <laughs> it seemed to be holding you rather well until we came along. Silent savage, or I will show you how steel is stronger than bronze. We must leave this place. I have a haven nearby. Let's go! Bring a friend. Hmm. I do not understand these two. They are very strange. 
They must be heroes in the mold of Stallion Quartermain, like Solomon. They share his bravado, his skill, his adventurousness. All heroes are good, yes? They oppose villains who are evil, as Lucian was. So why do Doc and Mandar seem so oppositional? Is one secretly a villain? Will they betray us at a critical moment? I suppose we must follow them to this safe haven of Mandar's to find out. I, I really love our oh, level up. Epic. That is so cool. We're now level 145, halfway through the world, apparently. Very cool. Um, I love the whole dialogue with um, design. Um, because I, I just find it so funny that he's basically like learning everything that we already know. I, I like it. I really like the relationship that we have with the nothing, if you want to call it that. Um, I think it's a, a, a weird but also cool thing. Um, right. Let's see. We'll be safe here for a while. So, Duck, I see you survived the quicksand. You are stronger than you look, Bagram. Whereas you are as strong as you smell. Would that I were even stronger. My own people cast me down, led by that winged dog, Moth Amon. I'll yet be avenged. Bagram, I'll be avenged. So, Duck, who is this friend of yours and what do they do? They fight better than you and have a cunning look. This is the wizard who saved me. A wizard? Yeah. More sorcery. Lackeys of Moth Ammon. I'll destroy you both. Okay. Um, right. We uh we have Duck Savage here. Very cool. Ice. Uh 400 ice damage plus one damage over time, plus one heal over time to yourself, I believe. Um, very cool. Ooh, yeah, this is a solo fight. Mandar, myth, rank 20 boss. And he has a little bit of health. 11,805. We're going to use uh, the... We're probably going to use Grim Reader, I'd say. But we'll, we'll do Duck Savage just to see what it looks like. Because might as well. Might as well see what it looks like. Very cool. Very epic. We've seen... I think we've seen all of the others so far. The Bantam and uh, Solomon Crane. So, next one, Duck Savage. We fizzled, of course, because I'm just so good at this game. So good at this game. Um, we're just going to blade. We will do it before the end of the fight, just because I think it's important to show. Um, but yeah, if we if we fizzle again, it's going to be very unfortunate. <laughs> very unfortunate. Uh, 16. Okay, he's got a little bit more damage than the other myth guys that we were facing before. Just a little bit more. Um, right, blade. Blade. Yes, very nice. Nice blade. And we do this. We do this. We do this. We see what, what does. There we go. No fizzle. Love to see it. Love to see it. Very cool. Crit. Oh my gosh. That's kind of cool. Not going to lie. That's kind of cool. Kind of cool. So it gives, I assume it gives a heal over time if... Um, the enemy that you hit with has a damage over time. So, yeah, that's what I would assume that means. It's, it's just kind of hard to tell, in my opinion, some of the new spells, like the conditional things. It doesn't really, like, say that that's what it does, so... Or that it has to be, like, a conditional. But, yeah, I assume that's the way it is. We're gonna faint, and then we're gonna hit. And then we're gonna cry if we don't kill. But we should. We should. I would be very surprised if we don't. I mean, he's not killing me anytime soon. Uh, since this is a solo boss, they kind of tone him down a little bit. And it's not like absolutely insane sort of boss. Just because that would be a little bit rude. Um, but yeah, he's, he's a little bit strong. Of course, the stun. Could have seen that coming a mile away. Could have seen that coming a mile away, honestly. But that's fine. Um, we try this again. We try again. He's going to Earthquake me next, and I'm going to be very, very upset. Or that. That also makes me very, very upset. That makes me significantly more upset than before. Why would he do this to me? Why, why, Manda? Why, why do you hate me? We do this. We'll put weaknesses on him. We can, we can probably finish with the Scarecrow and some other hits, I guess. That is so annoying. <laughs> oh, man. 
He just outplayed me so hard there. I have no counters to shields. Like, I have no counters at all to shields. And at this point, it would be too late to counter it anyway. So might as well hit through it and hope that my non-existent pierce is enough. Um, pierce and damage is all I'm relying on now. All I'm relying on. Oh no. Maybe my pet will mass faint after this, since we know it can. Um, and that would be good. How much pierce? 50. Okay, that's not too bad. That's not too bad, actually. A 54 shield. That's like a tower shield. That's fine. It didn't quite kill, but it's very near. And he's got two weaknesses now, so that's pretty cool. We could have, like, carried Monster Mash afterwards and just destroyed him. But Scarecrow. But Scarecrow. Also works. Kablamo. Kablamo Kajamo. Get out of my face oh. Yeah, crit. Dead. Bye. Bye, Manda. Bye. Thank you for fight. Hope you enjoyed. Please give good. Give good thing. Give good. Listen, Mandar, and see reason. Perhaps we can help each other. We seek the monitor, uh, fane of the Ancient One. Do you know where it is? The Ancient One? Madness! I'll not go back to that place of doom. He may be able to help us. Let's do some persuading. Some persuading? Hmm. I don't know about that one. I don't think Man Mandar can do persuading. I was about to say Mandoria. But that, that's the area. What now? You only beat me because there are two of you. Come to gloat, or would you fight me again? Mandar, I am not your enemy. Mothamon is. He's the enemy of everyone in Mandoria. He betrayed us both. Let's fight him together. If you truly fight against Mothamon, then I would fight beside you. But for Grom's sake, the Ancient One's fane must never open again. Why not? Look at the sky. The world has changed. We must find the knowledge of the Ancient One so we can understand what is happening. Once before, it was opened. And from it, streamed foul demons that sought to destroy Mandoria. Interesting. One seeks to discover. The other two defend. Both noble goals. How can they be reconciled? I believe you, Mandar. Here is my bargain. I help you overthrow Mothamon, you help me open the Sanctum, and we fight the demons together. Imagine how glorious the battle will be. The name of Mandar will be the stuff of legend. Surely with this wizard's help we will prevail. So be it. May Mithra guide our blades. I shall be king of Mandoria by my own hand twice by Grom. But how can I stand against Mothamon's magic? I have an idea. Come to my campsite. We can make our plans there. Let's go, wizard. Right, let us head to campsite. And then we're probably going to be finishing off very soon. Uh, let's talk to Duck Savage, though. Hello. Let's begin. Given the right materials, I can fashion a mana resonator that will shield you from Mothamon's spells. Grom's teeth, you think you know so much? If you are as clever as you are boastful, the device will surely work. Forge your resounder thing, then. Not so fast. I'll need specialized components. Gather some of the local crystal and raw mana from the local font. Draw it into this capacitor. I'll also need refined iron. The weapons of the local Mander hunters will do. Lastly, I'll need silver. A lot of silver. There is a tribe of hill people I led for many years. They'll give me the silver. I made them rich enough, the dogs. Wizard, you get the rest. Good luck. Right, next time we will be making a resonator thingy mabob to, to stop spells and stuff. Um, but yeah, otherwise, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Smash like, subscribe, and as always, remember to craft outside the box.